Where is it? Ah, stupid wind. I mean, ugh. not the wind. Wow, well, uh. Barely? Nope. Come on, close. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, well. Okay, come on. Just get this stupid thing. Okay. Yes! Okay, uh, welcome. Okay. Okay. Welcome back to Legends of Arcane Time 3D, episode 46. Uh, wow, this is going to probably be a really, really, these past two videos are probably going to be the biggest catch-up videos probably ever. Because I have missed so much stuff. Not even funny. Okay. So anyway, we are going to possibly get the possibly possibly no promises um probably going to get the uh, grand big one sword let's see um i would buy it like randomly cuz you can buy a big grand sword but okay the one that you buy breaks easily, and it costs 200 rupees, but it's really strong. It's stronger than the Master Sword, I think. If I'm right on that, I don't know. I'm, I'm probably not, because that's how much I suck. So anyway, uh, remember that cuckoo, the pocket cuckoo? Well, um, we are finally going to use that. So I said we were going to do it later, and this is very later. Anyway, coming here, you see... <laughs> Milan. No, not Milan. Wow, I'm such an idiot. It was... Pff, I forgot his name. Ah, okay, so anyway... But the cuckoo. What? Oh, yeah, yeah. Talon or something. Campers get a little shut eye around here. Did you save my lot of things? I'm gonna back to the ranch. Yeah. Okay, just stands there. But the next time you come in, he'll be gone. So yeah. In a way, after you do that, you wanna go back to the girl that you got the pocket cuckoo from. I don't see if it's a new invention. It's just. It just looks like a regular cougar, and wow. Wow. But smack! The chicken is smacking it, her butt. No, the chicken is smacking the girl's face with its butt. That's weird. Oh, your cougar looks pretty happy. He must be awake and very extremely lazy guy. Yes, he was extremely lazy, as Ingu said. You're a good cuckoo keeper. I'll give you a rare, valuable cuckoo if you're interested. Interested. This name is Kajuro, and it's used my brother's cuckoo, but blue cuckoo. It's blue body. It's quite charming. It's so cute. Because my brother has gone strange, but Kajuro has stopped crowing. Do you want to keep Kajuro or something? You return the pocket cuckoo and got Kajuro in return. Unlike the cuckoos, it's great. And the how it looks is different. Okay. Anyway, I also did not do this. I cannot believe I have not done this. Anyway, you want to come here and talk to this guy? He'll say, "Please see my other brothers too. I'm sure they'll give you something a lot better." Will you do it? Yes, I will do it. Talk to this guy. The curse has been broken. Thank you. Here's a reward for you. You get the adult, the giant wallet. It has, f it can hold 500 rupees, that is a big one. And the other one, I had no clue how to get it, but it's so simple. Chris is broken, thank you, here's a rope for you. You get the stone of, oh, shard of agony. If I pronounce agony right, it's probably not agony. It's like it's not agony, it's pronounced differently. So anyway, after you get that, now you can hold 500 rupees. And pretty much what the shard of agony does is if you get near a hole, it will start to glow. Because there's a. Obviously, there's a hole over there! And, uh. 
I gotta reposition my camera. And obviously, come on, is the Kona there? Oh, she's right there. Sneaky. Is there any way to get to her? Oh, I, I didn't even show her. Okay. I'll just save it for later, I guess. Anyway, where we want to go is over to... Where is it? The Kukiri Forest! Yeah. I think I actually... No, I did not pass it. Over here. Okay, kind of slow down. Okay, that's good. Get down. We'll have a there because we're going to have sort of a speed run, not too much a speed run. Sort of, we just have to do something you'll see if you have not played the game. So anyway, just go in here. Come around here. And so anyway, uh, this is pretty much just going to be me going around. So anyway, yeah, I've been... So anyway, um, I've been on Mario Kart 7 a lot lately because... I'm just kind of trying to play Makaloo as much as I can before the update. Because I know it's not going to change entirely, but I mean, that shortcut was sort of like awesome to me. So then we come over here, talk to him, and ugh. Is this no response? We should get his attention. Yes, so then bring up um, Juro or something. Yeah. Bajura, why normally only a nice guy like me can tame hit you, which means you, you must be a nice guy, must be, you must be, please, Mr. Nice Guy, please, deliver this to the old hag in the potion shop in Korea Village, this will disappear if you take too long, so you gotta hurry, which is good because I have three minutes, I have three minutes, wow, I have three minutes to make a, to end this video, and I got three minutes to get this odd mushroom over here okay so anyway we can just go over there at least that's what i usually do and if you try to use a warp which i don't know why you would on this one but there's another one that i would use a warp on but you can't use a warp on it because i okay it involves jumping fences and i I don't get the timing on opponent. I have only jumped about two fences, and that's about it. I'm just like, how are you supposed to time it? And apparently three minutes in this game is like half a day. No, three minutes in real world is like half a day here. It's, half, it's like half a day in this because, well... Anyway, just come over here. Wow, um, I gotta come on, make it, make it, make it. Stop, 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 stop. Okay, good, good, good opponent, good opponent, opponent. Just yes, keep on eating stone. And wow, we were going to make that from the start. And I actually still think we have time to finish this. Actually, anyway, you want to come over here? Come over here. Cut this corner at the right angle and you can just jump up pretty much and then cut it court. Okay, um, I've done better. But oh well, that cuts some time. I'm gonna come over here. Okay, I don't think I've act have actually showed this. This place, let's talk to her. Sniff, sniff, sniff. What a mysterious smell. You must have something. Yes, I do. That fool! He had to go into the forest, I see. Hey, give it to me now! Yes, I will. And this is just her on the camera, pretty much. And then, boom! She didn't do anything, and... If you see that fool, give this to him. It is the strongest medicine I have ever produced. However, this produce will not work on a monster. Okay. You see an odd poltice. You don't know what is going on between this lady and that guy. 
we take it to the last woods? I don't know either. The location of the young punk who wanted it is marked with on the map. So they say that there is no medicine that can cure a fool. I guess that's true. Anyway, if you talk to her again, ultimate potion. How about 100 rupees? Uh, don't change your mind. Come back. Yeah, so pretty much, um, this one doesn't spoil, I think. I'm pretty sure it doesn't, because if it does, then that sucks. But anyway, um, I'm going to end it off here in the next episode. We are going to get that, and probably go to the next thing. The ice cavern, yeah. See you guys then.